Welcome to the Word of the Week. Here we are in the cafeteria of the Phelps Student Center. Our word for this week is self-control. And it's the choice to deny your flesh. Ironically, we're in the cafeteria. It's always easy, especially I know that I'm older. I have to control myself after dinner and not snack, not snack in between meals. But the, it's a choice to deny your flesh. Our flesh says, pleasure yourself now. Do what's easy. Do what's convenient. The fruits of the Spirit say otherwise. We're supposed to put on love, joy, peace, long-suffering, gentleness, meekness. Can you control yourself? Can you deny yourself? Or do you just give in? Areas of life that Satan comes at us. I used, I used to have the, uh, the privilege and the opportunity to coach basketball here. And I loved correlating defensive stance to denying yourself. The idea of staying in a stance for an extended period of time, your legs and your back burn. It's the same skill set to look away when there's something inappropriate that you shouldn't look at. Or the same skill set to shut your mouth when you want to say something. Same skill set applies. Self-control. The choice to deny your flesh. What is it that we need to deny ourselves because God's word tells us not to and our flesh craves for it and we've got to deny ourselves. I trust that you rely on the power of God's word and his spirit to give victory in your quest to control yourself. This is an encouragement. Please share this with other people. I trust you have a great week. Thanks.